Let's start with the addition. How can we write the addition by using only the identity, fixator, and zero functions? To add a number b to a number a is similar to add b times 1 to the number a. For example, the addition of 3 and 2 is also equal to the addition of 3 and 1 plus 1, and it's also equal to the addition of 3 and 0 plus 1 plus 1. We notice that the addition of 3 and 2 is defined by the successor of the addition of 3 and 1, and this is recursive until the addition of 3 and 0. Now, how do we write this with the formal recursion? The addition of a and 0 equals to a function j that takes all the parameters without the last one, so only a here. Finally, a and 0 equals to a, but we cannot write just a. We can see that it's the first parameter of the function j, so we have id11, so j of a equals to id11. The recursion at a state m is a function h that takes all the parameters without the last one, so a, the iterator m, and the recursion a state before, here it's the addition of a and m-1. This is equal to the successor of the state before, but we cannot write the addition which is not in the base of our primitive recursive function. The addition of a and m-1 is the third parameter of the function h that takes three parameters, so we can write the successor id33. Finally, the addition is a recursion of id11 and successor of id33, and it's primitive recursive.